Hey guys, this is Kay here. Today is Tuesday, November 12, 2013. And um, just wanted to let you know that I had written a new blog post on my blog and thought you may um, want to stop by and check it out. Actually, the title is about why you should start a home-based business. And I can tell you, you know, while I was researching the topic, I found out something very interesting. I found out that over half of half of the small businesses, over 50%, actually have a home-based business. And at first, I said, wow, that's a pretty high percentage, you know. But then I thought, you know, this day and age, a lot of people want to be able to work from the comfort of their own home. They want to be able to leave their bed and walk a few steps to their home office and operate their business. So I can understand that. Um, but also, one thing that I pointed out, you know, a lot of people, they start home-based businesses mainly for one reason, and that's for the money. You know, a lot of people want to earn additional income or, or passive income. And another main reason, I guess you can say, that a lot of people join or start uh, home-based businesses is for job security. And I know that probably sounds very strange because we've heard it, you know, over and over again that go to school get good grades, graduate, and get a good job for the job security. Well, you and I both know, you know, over the past few years, we've seen so much turmoil in our economy with people losing their jobs, um, companies are downsizing, management changes, and so forth. And the job security that we thought we had, we realized we, we don't have it. You know, it's more like smoke and mirrors. And so a lot of, a lot of people have been looking at uh, other business opportunities to help supplement their income because they feel like it's just too risky to rely on one income, and it really is. Um, so anyway, before I go into the actual blog post, I just wanted to let you know um, that it is for you to read and check it out, and I also added um, eight good other reasons or benefits why you should start a home-based business. So for those of you who think, you know, no, I have my job, I'm safe, I'm secure, you may want to think again and take a look at my blog post. And one thing that someone told me this week, and it kind of stuck with me, and it made a lot of sense, and they stated to, uh, for those who, of you who don't think it's necessary to start a home business, he made a statement and, and said, you want to build your will before you're thirsty. And I said to myself, I said, wow, that, that, that makes a lot of sense. You want to build your well before you are thirsty. And if you're not knowing what I'm talking about, what it's basically saying is right now you may not need the additional income. You may not need to replace your income. But there comes a point in time where there are going to be changes that is going to force you to think that way. You know, it's, it's really in inevitable that... Um, change, you know, change is always around us. And not necessarily saying that you may lose your job, but you never know. You may have a family member that may need your help financially, and you're basically living check to check, and you're not able to help them. And, you know, you, you're wishing you could help them more, but you're not able to. But that's just one example. So what stuck with me, that quote, build your well before you're thirsty. So anyway, I won't go any further. Um, just wanted to invite you over to my blog, which is www.blogwithk.com, www.blogwithk, and that's k k a y dot com, and just um, take a look at my blog and share it if you if you if it uh, resonated with you, and also take a look around my blog. I have some other interesting articles that um, you may like to read. So anyhow. I will talk to you later and um, see you on the next video. Thanks.